Welcome back to Dracon's Plays, The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. Alright, so now that we have the grappling hook, the plan is to run around and do a whole bunch of cleanup. Um, because the grappling hook gives me access to a lot of places I could not go previously. I, I mean, a lot of places are now accessible. Alright, so that's a way of leading back down. Alright. Now then. Looks like there's some stuff on the other side, and yes, I know that chest is there. But... Why did those exist? Alright, so now I'm gonna grab that chest. Awesome, another power gem. Alright, so that's the way up. Oh, so you know about Hero Island, right? Yep. You do? Wow, really? And I thought I had something new to tell you. Okay. Weird. Alright. So, let's get some more treasures. Alright, because there are some more on this island. Hello. Do you know the old wayfarer lives on Benin? Buried something nice in front of his hut. Hmm, you don't say. I am going to be going to that island because there are multiple um, grappling hook things. All right. Big gold ruby, three hundred. Damn. Damn, I am rolling in the dough now. All right. All right. Awesome, another wisdom. Ah, keep your distance, guy. Yeah, I'm no do no do boo. Yeah, I got no house. And yeah, they called me no abode. Real clever. I got no abode. Ha ha. Go on, laugh at my frozen tears. Actually, you know what? I like being sad. Why do I you care? You want something from me? That's why you're here. Here's a secret for you. Anku with houses bury stuff in front of their signs. Bianku are tricky like that. What? Forget it. I'll say nothing more. Dig dig dig. Is it just in front of the house? Yeah. Alright. 
Oh, I saw that mail. Oh, boy. Man, I am getting so much money. Like, guaranteed chance of rupees? Alright, that is ludicrous. I now have 4,000 rupees. Like, wow. All right, what do you got for us, mailman? A letter from Gongoro of the Gorons. Ahem, listen up. Oh, this unlocks the minigame, doesn't it? My brother, Goro Dragon, how are you doing? I have it. I have decided to work part-time on a southeastern sea isle. Stop by if you're in the area, brother. I'll be the one rolling up in a ball making a spectacle of myself. P.S. Enjoy the gift. Your brother, Gono Goron. Courage, Jim. And that's the end of it. Ah, oh, the Courage ones give you like a sword beam or something, don't they? Mm, mm, mm. Look at you, kid! So you finally got that pure metal. Wahoo! Ah, this is a note I'm celebrate as if all our troubles are over. I will rest until we find those three pure metals. Oh, good. Jolene's back. Ick. Ick. Alright. That was horribly drawn, but it was close enough. You know what, let's make a pit stop at Beetle. Because I have a whole bunch of money. Alright. God damn it, Jolene. Ooh, a freebie card. No thanks, hold on. Oh, Regal Ring. Ah, oh, that's right. Hmm. I think that's the stupid, stupid valuable one. 1890? Chain handrail. Simple wheel. Do I have those? I do have chain. I believe I do have simple. Yes, I do. Yeah, it's Regal Ring in Black Pearl. Oh, that's right, I have something worth 800. Yeah, I'll use the freebie card. And I'll take this, please. That's gonna be valuable. Oh, 
Okay, that's... I hate Jolene. It's such... Like, everything to do with this is really poorly designed. Yes, yes, yes. Like, the fact that you can only hit her on her dash... ...is really annoying. And the way she chases you down is, like, ridiculous. One last thing to say, what do you got? Hope you're really proud of yourself! No, I'm just annoyed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 200 rupees. Damn, Limebeck. Alright, over to DS Island. I really do forget whatever... I really do forget what the last item in this game is. Not sure, because we do still have the one more item to get. Um, Goron Island has a little bit for us. And then that's pretty much it for this section of ocean, I think. Alright, welcome to the game that's all the rage! Yes, it's the Goron game! I'll take it first, Finn. Let me explain the simple rules of the Goron game. There are several targets scattered about the course, brother. Break all of them and the final path to the finish line will open. Think efficiently, think quickly, and most of all, think like a Goron and win. Did you get all that, brother? Yes. I will introduce your daring sidekick in the Goron game. He'll be the one actually rolling around the course for you. Go for it, Gongoro! Yeah! Brother! I am the one and only star on this island. My fans call me... Gongoro. Gongoron. What? Hold on. What are you doing here, Goro Dracons? We were wondering the same thing. I I've got a part-time job to help my dad make ends meet. I, I bet you'll... We'll be unstoppable with you rolling around, Goro Dracons. The best time so far is 35 seconds, brother. Well then, let's go Goron race. Alright. Close, but no cigar. Forty seconds. Consolation prize. Hundred rupees. Yes, I do. So I'm I'm actually up fifty rupees, which is awesome. Okay, so this one is not too bad of a mini game. Much better. Got it. A thrilling record, and you just set a new high. All right. Bomb shoe bag. No thanks. I think that's all the prizes for this one. 
But Bomb Tree Bag is super worth it. Alright. Now it's off to Goron Island, where we have a few places to go. Alright. So overall, we're, we're in pretty good shape here. Um, now, the Mass Salesman, um, which replaces Beetle, happens... Only during certain times. It's very particular, if I remember correctly. That's weird. I'm seeing, like, random spot off on the distance. Yeah, there it is. Weird. Huh. Was it those guys trying to load in? Very weird. Alright. Yeah. So, like I said, this episode's gonna be all about um, just random cleanup because the grappling hook grants access to a lot of chests scattered all around the world. trying to remember because there are a few islands that don't have any grapple points and thus it would be worthless to try um grappling to them yes please That feels good. Got another heart container. Oh, Ruto Crown. For 150? Really? Doesn't. Is that what it sells for? If so, you are the biggest cheapskate. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's its value. Do those guys' thing change it? Uh, I don't know. Because there's that boat that'll buy stuff for more, but the catch to it is... They only do that. Now, the catch is, I don't know when they switch up the item. Because if they switch it, like, now? Or, well, not now, but like on the same pattern as the stores. I'm out of luck. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to buy, because worst case scenario, I can sell for what it's worth. Alright. Yeah, worst case scenario, I can recoup the money. Which isn't a lot, anyways. Because I have... The vast majority... Of the, um, valuable metals. Or not metals. But valuable items that you can buy from stores. I mean, there's always gonna be ship parts, but... Yeah, you're always going to have ship parts, but the big, big valuable stuff, um, the heart containers, bomb bags, all that type of stuff, will always um, be similar in price. Now then. Up to Nanan Island up here. Now, I don't think that Island of... The Isle of Gust has anything for me. So I'll leave that be. I do have that 
um, treasure to get. Alright. And I also got the tip about the old man. Good. Treasure map. Oh, that's super conveniently placed. Alright. Cool. Yeah, so I, I don't think I'm going to do a 100% run on this because, like, getting all the ship parts and some of that stuff is really annoying. But I am going to try to get at least the vast majority of things. So, like, I'm going to try to get every heart container. Um, I definitely want to try to get most of the um, gems. I'm up to 19 minutes on the hourglass. And I believe it actually is 25. All right. Another courage. Awesome. Yeah, I thought so. I remember that one. Up towards Harrow Island. Ah, which I never looked up if there's more there for me. Look at the stone tablet on the left. Look at the stone tablet on the right. Look outside. If you look closely, something is scribbled here in very small letters. Very something. Be nice between the two treasure chests. Alright. So that tells you about that. All right, awesome. So that's that. All right, we're honestly in pretty good shape. How many courage do I have? Ten. Awesome, I can get the level one on everything now. And I have to go there anyways. Um, since there are more um, gem locations there. Yep, let's set sail. I really cannot remember what that final item is. Hmm. All right. And then we'll get those ships that are on the horizon. Because why not? That was almost super bad and careless. I hope this is like Sand of Hours or something. Alright, so if I have 19 minutes at current... There's a boss that grants me yeah there's a boss that grants me um more
So that will put me up to 21, which means there are three chests out there that have um, time for me. All right. Mermaid Prow. Awesome. All right, let's go get these guys. And then we'll be good. God damn it, Jolene. Alright. So next up, we'll warp down... Um. Yeah, to this self. Where we have a few more places where we'll be able to um, grapple to and get some more stuff. We'll also be able to upgrade um, a couple of our fairies. And we'll go from there. All right. Now, let's see, what do we got? Please be a good... Bellsprout? That one I have. Taurus. Mermaid. No, I did not have Bellsprout. That's actually good. All right. And away we go! I really wish I had a way to check, like, treasure charts I've found. Is that actually in here anywhere? Oh, 15. Well, quantities there. But there's not, like, a number attached to each one like there was in, um, Wind Waker, which makes it super easy to collect them, um, or, well, figure out which ones you're missing. Um, and, like, insult a walkthrough or something, since they're all numbered, so it's like, yeah, you explicitly always know which ones you're short. Which is honestly super useful. All right, there we go. All right. Now then, let's see. All right, what is this one? Ah, simple wheel, that sucks. All right. Oh, that's right, the Southern Isles there also have stuff I need. Man, there are so many places you need to go after you get the grappling hook.
All right. There we go. All right. So I can't remember if I got a thing from in the um, temple, so I'm quickly going to stop in there. Alright. Because there's a spot in here. Conveniently located at the boss. I did not. Completely forgot about this. But I remembered it was conveniently located on my way. 12, 13, 14. Sweet. Nice. That was exactly what I needed. Alright, god damn it. Damn, twenty four hundred. Alright. Now then, let's see. Nice power. Really? Alright, and he always drops a red. So that's super worth it. Alright. Not bad. There it is. I really do forget whatever that final item is. Nice. Ah. All right. Do you have anything different in this shop? No, you do not. 
All right. All right, so that's that. All right, so I guess with that, I'm actually going to wrap this one up here. Next time, we're going to go through, um, go to that southern island. Um, what's the name of it? Spirit Island. Go down there, get that. Go to the Isle of Ember, get that. And the um, treasure right there. Get all those. Um, and then we'll return to Marquet Island, where we'll um, do a little bit of cleanup there and enter the Temple of the Ocean King once again. So anyways, I'll wrap this one up here, and I'll see all of you guys later. Bye!